This will be a place of pilgrimage, a place of hospitality for all. An historic day for Oklahoma Catholics. Thousands of people were on hand for the dedication of the Blessed Stanley Rother Shrine in South Oklahoma City. It honors the Okarchi native who in 2016 became the first American-born Catholic martyr. News Force Kaylee Olivas is there live. And Kaylee, people from all over the country were in town for today's dedication. Yeah, Kevin, that's right. Several priests came today from out of state. There were also several people who were in attendance who traveled hundreds of miles just to be here. We spoke with a couple of guys who drove in from Missouri this morning just for the mass and the dedication this morning. They say although they were in dire need of coffee and food, it was well worth it. Stanley Rother is the first martyr from the United States to be recognized by the Catholic Church and the first U.S. born diocesan priest to be beatified. Which puts Rother one step away from sainthood. To honor the life of faith he led, a 2,000 seat shrine was built. I was expecting, like, I heard about him, like, oh, there'll be a little shrine or something. Then I come here, it's just this massive church, uh, just like this beautiful property. All these people here, all just like, all united together, uh, praising God. It's amazing. Born in Okarchi, Rother was ordained as a priest in 1963. He went on to serve as a missionary priest in Guatemala in the late 1970s. He was then murdered by three men in his rectory in 1981. His killers never caught. Interestingly enough, I'm a very distant relative of Blessed Stanley Rother. Oh. I just was very drawn to his life and his his martyrdom. Although decades ago, people still feel connected to him. He, along with thousands of others, converged on the grounds Friday, all wanting to witness history. I just felt like I had to come down for it. Blessed Sandy Rother belongs to all of us, as does this shrine. It was definitely a beautiful ceremony to be a part of, just watching everyone, the, the overjoyed looks and the happiness sitting in the crowds. This will mark, the shrine will mark, the uh, Oklahoma's largest Catholic church that the state has. Along with the shrine, there is also a museum and a pilgrim center that is now open to the public. In South Oklahoma City, Kaylee Levis, Oklahoma's News 4. Thank you, Kaylee. The Rother family, one of the great families in Oklahoma.